everybody can do better than this. It's quite possible we can do better than this. That looks cooler. Lighting's better. View is a little better. The lean, oh, that's much better. That is a much better. Let's see if we can slide this over here and get set up. Ah! Doing the best I can. Doing the best I can. Sometimes the best we can is all we can do. And we're not gonna do a whole hell of a lot better than that. But we can tweak with it, tweak it. And try and get that going and see how that works. Hello, Everlasting Bloom. Whoa! Had just the weeest bit of Kleenex in my pocket. It's actually a paper towel. I'm not above using any absorbent, pro absorbent? Is there a D in there? I don't know, absorbent? Absorbent? I think it's just absorbent product. Uh, paper product to blow my nose. Oh, no, I'm not. Hello, Atrene. Hello, Marianne. Hello, Katrina Spears. Hello, Paige. Hello again, Heather, User Mentz, Eli, Betty. Oh, wow. Right at the cusp. Merrily. IDK. I've got my eyes on you, IDK. Hello, Texas Dream. Steve Melanson. Chrissy. Ginger. Tara Fink, J-H, and you, sir. Good afternoon, or not good afternoon. It's really good morning. Good morning, good morning to you. But I've already said that to you this morning, so it feels a little bit funny saying it again. I want to say good afternoon, but here it is. It's about 10 to noon on uh, Friday morning, and I feel in error to say good afternoon. But good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon to you anyway. Uh, my name is Ken Tracy, and this is Thoughts from the Gym. This is a little show. It's a spinoff of my uh, morning show I do every morning, uh, my Coffee with Ken show live, uh, that I do at about 8 o'clock every morning, uh, where I have my first sip of coffee with you, the viewer, and I have a lot of fun doing it, and I talk about a bunch of things. Kind of wanted to create more content. Uh, went out on a, a little journey of mine to get uh, my physicality uh, in a little better shape. And four weeks ago, I joined uh, Planet Fitness here in Naperville, uh, where I live. Naperville, Illinois is a town about 145,000 people, about 35 miles west of Chicago. It was right on the way home, uh, and I would go there after work every, uh, any day I worked. And uh, went there this morning. I set a goal, a very verbal, very oral, very spoken goal. And I don't know, I don't know how I feel now about setting uh, such public goals, but I stated that I wanted to do one pull-up in uh, my first full month of training. I'm four weeks in, I still got three days left, uh, but again, I'm not able to do one pull-up after four weeks. And I felt a little dejected. I was hoping to get a little closer to completing that one pull-up today, uh, but I look back at the progress I've made over the last four weeks and I'm proud of it. Uh, I'm getting stronger at bench, getting stronger at curls. My core's feeling better. I don't know if I've lost an ounce or that the, my body shape has changed any, but I feel better uh, every day after working out. And I think you should set goals. I think it's important. I think it's fun. It kind of keeps us on task. Uh, but if you don't achieve those goals, that's fine too. And you just uh, either reset the time frame or reset the numbers. And I still have a couple workouts in to see if I can get a pull-up done by Monday. Uh, not sure if I will or won't. And honestly, how I felt today, I don't think I will. <laughs> but I don't want to give up yet. I still got two workouts to do. And uh, felt great though working out. And again, I was talking to a couple buddies the other night about it. And I used to work out regularly. I used to be a marathoner and a competitive track and cross country runner. But I kind of got... Uh, sidetracked over the last couple of years as I've worked through other stuff, personal stuff and spiritual stuff and mental issues that I was facing and kind of lost track of uh, just working out. And I'll tell you what, I say it every day, uh, but it feels so good <laughs> to go into the gym. And again, my workout's only about half an hour. I do bench curls, uh, core and pull-ups and some serious stretching. But it only takes a half hour. I get a 15, 20 minute shower at the end. And I'll tell you what, it's worth it just for that. And as I'm toweling off, I always go, oh, that feels so good. So good. 
because I'm done. My muscles feel alive. My body feels awake. My mind feels at peace. And I know I accomplished something good for myself mentally and uh, physically on that day. So if anybody's thinking about getting back into it, I'd encourage you. I can't tell you how good it feels. Uh, and again, I just joined a Planet Fitness. It's like 50 bucks a year uh, dues and $10 a month. And I was looking at a more expensive gym, twice divorced as I am with bills, more bills than I do paychecks. Uh, uh, couldn't be more pleased with the gym I'm at. And it's clean, it's got all the weights you want. I, everything's pretty available. It's never too, too crowded. And I'm getting a great workout three or four times a week. And it just feels really, really good. So uh, I don't have a whole lot else for you. I'm going over to Starbucks right now, drink some coffee, work on some vid video editing. I've got a backlog about three weeks of these live videos uh, that I uh, need to get through to get current with my videos because I have a ton of fun doing this. And I am transitioning now from a full-time realtor into a full-time content creator. And I'd like to do this for a living when I grow up. And since I'm 55, <laughs> I better grow up soon. So that's my goal and that's what I'm doing. But again, I got a lot of work to do and it's a lot more work than most people think. Uh, it's not just hopping on the phone and talking. There's a lot of behind the scenes stuff uh, that's not as glorious <laughs> as this. But uh, anyway, that's probably all I have for you. This is Thoughts from the Gym. I think this is episode 17 in uh, 28 days. One of the episodes I did after a swim workout. So I think I've been uh, to the gym 16 times in the last four weeks. That's four times a week, which is about perfect. Doing pull ups every time thank you josh doing pull-ups every time and again for anybody that's scared to get started because they don't know if they look cool or be embarrassed at the gym i'm a guy with a serious ego and confidence and i went in there and couldn't do one pull-up and i've been working hard at it for four weeks and i still can't do one pull-up so if i can go and make a fool of myself going, rah, 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 and not I get one. Uh, don't worry about it. Uh, don't you know? put aside what other people think and what you think of other people because it doesn't matter what you think of other people or what other people think of you. Uh, do what uh, is right for you and uh, be the best version of yourself. And honestly, if we can't take care of our physicality, I don't even know if that's a word, our body, <laughs> or work out every, a few times a week, we're probably not doing the best job for us. So... Uh, uh, just wanted to hop on and say, hey, uh, Josh said nice jacket. It's because it's a beautiful day. I'm riding my scooter, and this is the uh, scooter I, or the jacket I ride uh, with, uh, and it feels great. And I'm so excited to ride on over to uh, Starbucks, get some coffee, might be meeting a buddy out there, and uh, do some editing, and uh, in, enjoy the rest of my day. So thank you so much for joining. I hope you're feeling good. Hope you're working out today. Hope you get a workout in today. I'd love to see anyone post uh, any achievement they've made. I can't tell you how excited I'll be to, uh, when I can tell you guys I actually got up and did one whole pull-up. Uh, hopefully it'll be my Monday, but if it's not, that's okay. Uh, I'll just set a new goal, maybe a week out or what have you, and I'll get there. Uh, one thing I am is determined. So I hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you're feeling good. I hope you are loving yourself. Huh. Hope you're forgiving yourself. And as always, I hope to talk to you soon. Bye-bye.